Hey guys, and welcome to another video. If you guys are new here, welcome. My name is Natalie, and if you guys are returning, you already know. I totally appreciate you. So for this video, I decided to do this little um, grungy, smoky eye type look for when you want to go out, you want to go on a date night. Um, it's super easy. It's super quick. It only involves like two or three shadows. Like I'm not even going to lie. And it's a beautiful, simple sexy look I think um, so yeah um, in this video I definitely will not show you how much how I put the rest of my makeup on is usually just focus on the eyes just because everything is the same other than the fact of my eyelashes and my lips which you will see um, but without further ado do not forget to give this video already a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and let's get into the video All right guys so Obviously, you one thing that you'll notice is I don't have my eyelash extensions on. Um, I took them off and I'm gonna get them back, but totally look different without them because eyelashes are life. <laughs> but so, um, I did my eyebrows already, and um, for my eyebrows, I used the LA Girl Shady Slim Brow Pencil in X um, Brunette. Um, it actually looks darker, but I did that, and then it flew. <laughs> and then I did for foundation is my LA Girl. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do this really nice brown smoky eye you can use for a night out or a date night. Um, I'm not gonna do the rest of my makeup in front of you guys because basically it's the same products that I'm using over and over again. Um, I will show you what eyelashes I'm using because obviously in other videos I always just have my eyelashes already on and you guys never see me put the eyelashes on when I do have um when I don't have my eyelash extensions so I will show that part but so let's get into it so I'm gonna add a little bit of the infallible full wear onto my eyelid just to give it a little bit of a um to prime them a little bit and then we are gonna go in and do this video. Also a little trick, I don't put foundation under my eyes because I'm gonna put concealer anyways and I don't want it to look cakey. So I just don't put any on there. Okay, so I have primed my eyelids. So we're gonna use the Jaclyn Hill palette for this um, look because it does have a lot of rounds that I can use. Um, so I'm gonna go in and set my eyes and for setting I'm gonna use this one right here and that one is called Beam. set my eyes because you already know they will crease. Morphe M441 brush and I'm just gonna go in with this shade right here and that one's called butter and I'm gonna use that for the um, for my crease Once I have done that, I am going to start packing on the deeper brown onto my eyelid. So I'm thinking we can go in and use this one right here. And that one is called, 
um, mocha. And I'm just going to put that onto my eyelid. And then I'm going to go in with my other Morphe brush, which is not in here. What is going on? I'll just go in with the same brush. Same. And I'm just going to blend the crease part because obviously there's going to be, it's going to be harsh lines. So I'm going to go in with this deeper brown right here, and that one is called Buns. And put that I don't have my eyelashes I am like not the same <laughs> um, my crease just to blend it and I'm gonna go in and add that deeper color again because a little bit of it kind of like fell off. So I'm just gonna deepen it a little bit more. Blend, blend, blend. It's very grungy, I want to say. That's it for the eyes. That was quick and easy. I am going to finish the rest of my face and then I'm gonna come back to put the, show you what eyelashes I'm gonna put on and then my lip combo that I've been obsessed with and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I've added my highlight, my blush, my bronzer. I've even done a wing liner. I usually don't do wing liners so, um, I, so it takes some time, but um, so for lashes that we're gonna go in with, we're gonna use. If you guys have watched my videos from before, know that I am totally obsessed with Bamosha lashes, and look how beautiful these lashes are. Like they are so gorgeous. Um, I recently had found them on when I went down to the Santee Alley. Um, I. I one flew off. Um, I actually was um, able to meet the owner of Bamosha Lashes and um, got some sets of um, eyelashes from her when I first bought and now I have a discount code with them so it'll be down in the descri description box. Um, 
I am obsessed. She sent me um, PR lashes as well, and I'm obsessed with these lashes. So I'm gonna go ahead and use these. And for eyelash glue, I'm just using the Star Glue Eyelash Adhesive in dark. Um, actually, I think I got these when I had ordered some eyelashes online. Um, they came in the mail. They came with them. It's been a hot minute since I've like had to wear strip lashes. But I just wanted to give like my eyeballs a break from getting eyelash extensions. Um, I'm gonna go back, but I just needed a little break from them and it's always good to get like a new set here and there. So I'm gonna let those get sticky a little bit. While those get sticky, I'm gonna go ahead and do my lip. I've been obsessed with this lip combo and it's um, the NYX uh, Retractable Lip Liner in Natural. And the NYX Liquid Suede in 07. This lip combo has been like my go-to lip for everything. So I'm gonna go ahead and line my lips. And as I line them, I do add some of the color inside my lip. lashes and I cannot find my tweezers so bear with me because I'm gonna have to do these with my nails and my nails are long Also went ahead and did um, some of the eyeshadow. I like put it under my eye. Um, but that's pretty much it for this like grungy type um, date night eyeshadow. Um, obviously, oh yeah, my hair's short again. <laughs> I forgot <laughs> to mention that. But. That's pretty much it for this little go out date night look. Um, I hope you guys liked it. Um, don't forget to leave me a comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up. If you didn't like this video, still give a video, give this video a thumbs up. Ugh, I'm all over the place. And um, don't forget to subscribe. We have passed our 300 subscribers, which I am totally grateful for every single one of you guys. Um, I'll definitely be doing the ColourPop giveaway. I'm thinking for this giveaway, there's gonna be two lucky winners, one grand prize winner and one second place winner. So I'm so excited about that. And it's gonna be coming soon. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.